listen, I'm not I, I'm not against cops and prosecutors. I I'm against when you think what you did is harmless. You're an Italian. He's an Italian, I would assume, right? What you did to your own kind on many occasions, you have no flaws. Your mom and dad was perfect. Depending on their upbringing, that's an insult to me. My, my, my upbringing was impeccable from my family. I'm the total opposite of what they were. And I don't think so. I think I got a good side. And I think I got the good side from them. But when you sit down and you make judgments like that, I don't know. Of course he don't know me from a fucking hole in the wall. So he can't really make a proper decision. I don't think I instilled anything negative to my son and my daughter. I probably did in our way. Maybe your mother and father, maybe your mother and father or your mother and father had, and, and put something in your mind in a way and we're going to blame them because you're not 100% like he wants you to be. I don't, I don't buy that. Now, there's a lot of things your mother and father teach you that are wrong, but they mean well. There's a difference. He don't understand that. There's a, they'll tell a girl what to do. Mm -hmm. Maybe they're wrong. Maybe it won't work for them. But they meant well. Now, the times change. So it may not work out well for the girl or the guy or whatever. There's your environment, the neighborhood, your friends, your relatives, other people, your marriage. There's so many fucking things that form your life and how you think. Things you see. I saw the movie Jaws. I saw that fucking shark eating people, bro. <laughs> I, I, I'm like a little dick. I don't, I don't go past my knees in the fucking water. Bro. Neither does Gerard, by the way. <laughs> this guy must have your genes. I think God, he had a temper. I, um, um, I think John was more of a narcissist. I think a lot of people say, well, I don't think he ever shot. No, well, I, I put your head in front of him when he's holding the gun. See what he'll do. I think he'll blow your fucking head off in two seconds flat if he wanted to. So to say he didn't pull the trigger, he gave an order, he can kill him, for sure. I think he got, he had a temper and a half. Um, I think there was a couple of situations where his neighbor, there was an accident and they killed the neighbor and the neighbor disappeared and all that bullshit. But I think he was goaded into that by his wife, drove him fucking nuts. Plus he was sick about it, losing his child. He made a mistake. You're killing somebody, an innocent person. My son was hit by a car. My neighbor, he's still, I think he's still alive, but if he's dead, he's 100 years old. So that's the only reason he's dead. In other words, I didn't kill him. I wouldn't do that. But uh, it's an accident. So I don't know, I don't want to label John as he loved to kill. I don't think he loved to kill any more than I didn't love to kill. He did what he had to do for the life. I loved him. I was attached at the hip with him. He turned on me, backstabbed. I turned on him. We played chess. I checkmated him. Simple as that. I have no hard feelings towards him. If we were alive together now, and I know what I know now, I would shoot him in the fucking head in two seconds flat. Boom! Right now, I'm behind, and the government knows it. Every case he beat, I'm fucking behind it. Bribing people, threatening people, doing all kinds of shit. Making things disappear. Killing people for you. We're in Gozenosha together, we're brothers. It's your tape. It's you on tape, not me. And you want to sacrifice me. You want to help the government put me away. So I, I turned on him. If you turn on me, I will turn on you. I don't turn on people. I don't backstab. I don't fuck people. But if you turn on me or you fuck with me, I'm going to fuck with you or I'm going to turn on you. I don't take it lightly and I'm, I'm aggressive in that fashion right away. 
And that's what happened. But I do love him. I feel bad how he died. He died like a fucking animal in prison. And this guy talking about him, he loved him. Oh, fuck you know. Fuck you know, you fucking asshole. What do you know? People may say, you know, they, they call him the American mayor, okay? And the streets of New York, if you, you know, ask regular guys that are not in the life, and you ask about Rudy, they'll say he cleaned the streets of New York. I felt safer because of Giuliani. Mm -hmm. I felt safer because of what Rudy did. Yeah. Law and order gave me a certain level of peace. I was living in that community. I was scared for my life. I was scared of what was going to happen. And you hear these stories. You hear these stories being told. I felt that way. Okay. I liked what he did. Okay. As a mayor. Got it. So him cleaning the streets on what he did. Yeah. You can boast about that all the fuck you want. You can even boast about being a cop. I know plenty of cops and agents. They have a job to yeah. look for me, a bad guy, and put me the fuck away. I'm sure. not mad at them. Don't do that. Don't say that. What the fuck do you know about John Gotti? Oh. Is my opinion. Shut your fucking mouth in that area. 